Good evening. Thanks for joining us. It has taken more than a year, but a suspect has now been arrested and charged with the murder of a young girl in Burnaby last summer. Police found the body of Marissa Shen in the bushes of Central Park, not far from her home. The crime especially disturbing because homicide investigators believe she was the victim of a random attack. The CBC's Tina Lovegreen has our top story tonight. 14 months after Marissa Shen's murder, finally, some answers for her grieving family. Suspect is in custody. 28-year-old Ibrahim Ali was arrested in Burnaby, B.C. on September 7th, 2018 and was charged with the first-degree murder of Marissa Shen. Police say the man charged is a Syrian national. He came to Canada as a refugee 17 months ago and had only been in Canada for three months when Shen's body was discovered. Investigators say he's a permanent resident and lived with his family in Burnaby. Prior to uh, us having contact with uh, this individual, uh, he was not known to us, uh, the police environment. Uh, I can say that he does not have a criminal record. Police still believe the attack was random, meaning that the alleged killer and Shen didn't know each other and no word on a possible motive. I am not able to discuss these matters in order to protect our future judicial proceedings. Shen was last seen entering a Tim Hortons at around 6 o'clock on the night she was killed. Police found her body early the next morning in Burnaby Central Park, which is right across from where she lived with her mother. It's very sad for her mother to step out of such tragedy. Yeah. Valentine Wu has been in touch with Shen's mother and says while today's news brings some relief, more work needs to be done. We still pushing the city uh, to do what they promised uh, to install, for example, the CCTV. And many residents say they still avoid going to the park. Because what if somebody else is there who has committed something and we don't know, we are not aware of it? While some residents continue to feel anxiety, others are remembering Marissa for her kindness and hoping for justice. She deserves justice because this case has been going on for too long. The suspect, Ibrahim Ali, is scheduled to appear in court on Friday. Tina Lovegreen, CBC News, Burnaby.